is an evidence-based clinical profession. Uh, we work alongside uh, speech therapists, physiotherapists, occupational therapists in health settings, special education settings and often with people with learning disabilities. The AMA Music Therapy Programme offers a unique experience for students to come and train as a qualified music therapy practitioner. Music therapy is a discipline that requires uh, a lot of skill in a lot of different areas. So one has to be a very competent musician, but one also has to be very academic and very analytical. One of the sort of fundamental pieces is the relationship that's created between the therapist and the person. And within that, there's sort of a triadic relationship between the music, the therapist and the client. The core of our course is the clinical placement. So each semester, the students go out on placement with a qualified, experienced music therapist who guides them through the, their work placements. And this is really the crux of where you learn how to be a music therapist. This includes placements in an observation context, in a practice context where they're supervised by qualified music therapists in health contexts, in educational contexts, but also with community groups. I think it's really only in the clinical context that the student skills are really tested. Having students on site in my organisation, creative arts therapy students, including music therapy students, has really changed the culture and the arts and health have really become embedded in the hospital that I work in because of creative arts therapy students. I enjoy watching students' skills grow and as they become more independent practitioners and I particularly like sharing the moments of joy or breakthrough that uh, students have. It's on these fieldwork opportunities that students really get to see the marriage of theory, practice and research. Music interacts and has a relationship with health and well-being and we see in our work and I've seen personally lots of moments with people where music makes a huge difference in terms of um, their communications, really about um, bringing music to people who wouldn't access traditionally music venues or music opportunities and giving people the opportunity to communicate and express themselves emotionally through music. We're all really aware of how profound our experiences of music often are, so again in harnessing that and really using music to achieve something or to change something, um, I think it makes a lot of sense.